hello, hello. First off, guys, let me know right now. We have some fans on in the background. Is that getting picked up off of the mic? Let me know right now. We have some fans on in the background. Okay, so you can turn it down a couple then. Okay, that should have been way better now. Just put yeah. on low, maybe. No, we're good enough. It is, but not bad. Okay. Sounds like an AC unit. <laughs> kind of. Kind of is. Okay. Welcome in, friendos. We got Sammy here next to us. Happy Monday. Hello, Jay from England. Good to see you. Welcome in. Punisher was first this morning. So awesome. And yeah, this is our second Monday stream in a row. So welcome back everyone that wants to contribute to our menu planning for the week coming up. Hi to Kimmers, hope you're good. Hi Cookie, are you working hard today Cookie? Bonk, good morning. Hi Uki, how have you been Uki? Oh man, I don't know if you saw, we had a gaming stream last, what was it, Wednesday? Yep, Game and stream on Wednesday, we played some Animal Crossing and I was just like showing everyone, Uki, all this stuff that you've given to me over the years. So good. Hi Matt, how are you? Good day, Vyun. How are you doing? Vyun! Yeah, all ye rascals in chat. And yeah. oh my gosh, ah! Starting the stream with the <laughs> Mrs. Ruby Raid! Hi, hi, hi! A Katie comes into a Kate stream. Hello. All of the good eggs. Maybe a couple bad ones. I don't think so, though. How did things go today? I didn't see what you were streaming, so feel free to let us know how it went, what you got up to. Thank you as well, Katie. Coming in here with 16 biddies. Thank you for that. Thank you for the new follow, Skidmark. Hi. Scuba Vince. Welcome, Dragon McWagon. We got Max Peck in here. Shayna, hello. Mrs. Ruby just kicked you out of her kitchen. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, go get the kiddos. Are they already in school? Is that what's happening right now? Gotta go pick up the kiddos from school. Matt, your mom finally got the call to get the double lung surgery. She's under right now. Oh my gosh. I remember giving you like a little bit of money for when you were raising money for her to get this surgery. That's so exciting, dude. I hope it goes well. I hope she recovers quickly. I cannot believe that was two years ago already. Pumped for it. And hopefully... I mean, she comes out better than how she went in, right? Three months recovery time. So happy for you, dude. I'm sure that was just something else to deal with over two years, especially through COVID. Katie says, I started some pita, but I got sidetracked and made cookies. It's, it was a whole thing. Hey, that happens, right? The fun of the live stream. Wow, they've already been in school for four weeks. That's nuts. I didn't think it was that long already. Hopefully they're enjoying it too. I always love your little photo update every time they go back to a new year of school. <laughs> Nike, believe it or not, I'm walking on air. Hey, that's a good way to start the week. Not even upset. Yeah, that's such good news, Matt. Pumped for you and definitely let us know how it goes, right? Keep us updated, okay? Punisher, you're using your sous vide to do an entire chicken today. I will be honest, I have never done that before. So also I'm let us know that. how that goes. <laughs> Did you break it down first or you just put the whole chicken in? Seven hours in the water, 20 minute broil. Sweet. Hey, nice, Jay. Public holiday in the UK, so having a beer and resisting the idea to order takeout. Never a bad thing. Never a bad thing to order takeout. That's A-OK. -okay. okay, so welcome to a new week. What we have been starting to do is we added a Monday menu planning stream. I typically menu plan on Mondays anyways for the stream, so I thought let's add a new experience for the community and maybe get some people to contribute. 
and give us some new ideas of what we want to cook later on this week. Had a lot of fun last week doing that. We got some good pointers, we can say, from some people in our community. Got a good idea for the adobo chicken last week. We're crossing off some pots and pans redemptions while we're at it. It's just perfect. Vune ordered takeout today and they brought the wrong thing. Was gonna complain, but I noticed I messed up my order. No! So it was user error then? <laughs> Nike, you'll see yourself out. No, please stay. Mmm, do something with salmon. I will be honest, probably not gonna be a lot of salmon streams here unless I somehow luck out and get good quality, not farmed. It's hard to find where we're at in the prairies now, but I was thinking, I think Cookie said something about we haven't done shrimp in a while, and I think we can get really nice quality shrimp from Costco frozen still, the Argentinian one. So that could be nummies. Hello, you're looking great today. Yes, yeah, spatchcock the chicken before you broil. Pro tip right there. Love it. Oh, okay. So Punisher, they already spatchcocked it for the sous vide. Okay. Lays flat in the bag, cooks even. That is a very good way to do that. For sure, let us know how it goes. Oh, no. That's way off, Yoon. Wanted a carbonara, but you got diavola noodles instead? I mean, that's still yummy, but not the same at all like at all okay so last week we used our little planner or notebook to go over what we want to make this was our page from last week so we did thursday friday saturday sunday went through all the days that way and then we also wrote our grocery list at the bottom of the page as we added stuff to the menu for the week and that way we won't forget You're gonna do a chili, Jay? That sounds good too. Okay, so we're gonna start there again. And then the other thing I always bring up just for myself to be able to cross some stuff off is the channel point rewards queue where people have requested some menu redemptions using their pots and pans points. We did Misha's Paris Burest last week and we were gonna cross off double taps schnitzel ended up being that double tap had to work on the day that we planned it so i said well first thing coming up this week on thursday we're gonna get that schnitzel done and over with they've waited long enough next time you redeem something it'll be for sammy again oh a pork hawk challenge viewing in his pork hawk redemptions i'm in a different way Oh, you make it while he makes it? I like that view. And I would like to do that with some other people's money redemptions as well. I have a double shot coffee this morning from Rando, and I will admit I'm a bit shaky and that's okay. This is what I wanted. All of the caffeination. And also... Not sure if everyone saw the message in Discord from Sam, but he is COVID free, let's say. We COVID free. COVID does not exist in his body. He just, I guess, had a 24 hour cold, which is, that is good to hear. Yeah. I was like, you're still sleeping on the air mattress. <laughs> Hey, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, boom. Mrs. BC with the prime gaming sub. Ten months in a row now. You're the worst. Don't even look at me. You're the worst. I looked at you. <laughs> Thank you for being part of the kitchen crew for ten months, Mrs. BC. Hopefully we've taught you something along the way. And Barracuda, yeah, welcome in. We have added a Monday stream. To the mix for the week last week we added the first one for menu planning and everyone enjoyed it so much that they asked if we could do it again so here we are it'll be about three hour stream today chilling get ourselves ready for the week 
maybe end with a couple of little games. We'll see how it goes. Okay, so like I said, I've already told Double Tap that we're gonna do their schnitzel meal on Thursday. Did we break it, Vion? I mean, typically the hype command does work. <laughs> Hello? Fuck. Hello? It's Monday. Let's give it a rest. <laughs> He's like, commands. <laughs> oh, Mish. Hello, Mish. Just had some Mongolian beef nom, she says. Nom indeed. Did you make it or you went out for it? Okay, so 75k pots and pans for double tap. Double tap one, we can say. And the correct term is Jaeger schnitzel. You made the Mongolian beef. I don't even know if I've made Mongolian beef before. Like I've had hot pot, is that similar to it? So Jaeger schnitzel, I think that one also includes a mushroom sauce, is the Jaeger part of it, right? Yeah. Traditionally made from pork, accompanied by a creamy mushroom Jaeger sauce. Sweet! Schnitzel with mushroom sauce. And then they set a simple side with it. And hi, Daph! You see a Sammy? Oh, Daph, I am on the coffee this morning. Rando double shot latte. Pro. So good. Yeah, Jay, I've had a Jaegermeister. Oh. Do people in chat need to be reminded about Jaeger? Nice, Vion. Yeah, how dare. How dare, right? Okay, so what would you typically have with schnitzel? I'm asking Vion right now. Because he's in Germany. What goes on this side of schnitzel? I can see some served with rice or maybe some potatoes. Do you want to do a German potato salad with it? Or fries? I do still have some oil from our chippies yesterday. Kartoff, kartoffel salad. Sauerkraut or cabbage, that's a good one too. I mean, spetzla is really easy to make. We know this. And hi, Chase. Welcome in. <laughs> I don't know if Sam is really paying attention. He's playing Borderlands, but I'll read it out. Daph sent his brother a pic of the barbecue on the BGE. Called him to tell him that the temp controller is cheating. I don't think it's cheating. <laughs> Croquetting and bitter balling? So y'all want us to fry it up then, are you saying? We're back on the deep frying train? Let's go. <laughs> White Dove, you having a good Monday morning so far? Okay, I do like the idea of cabbage. One of my like favorite simple sides is just frying up sliced cabbage or like julienne cabbage with grated carrot and like butter. Maybe a little bit of shallot. It's really yummy. Do you like that? He's not paying attention. Zero input from this one over here. He's feeling better, so that's it, I guess. <laughs> what? What did I do? You're not being involved. Yeah, that's right. You're one still headphone talking. off. No, I'm asking you about what you want. Oh. Uh... We're giving Sammy Hex. He needs it. <laughs> I was asking if you liked the cabbage and carrot, like, sautéed together, or if that's weird. No, I think that's weird. See? What if we made that chat? Then Sammy would have been like, this is weird. And I would have been like, well, we already asked you about this. <laughs> sheesh! Can I get a <coughs> sheesh, please? Yeah, work with us, Sammy, please. 
A gherkin salad? Okay, you guys are pulling out all these words that I don't even know what they mean. Gherkin salad? A, a pickle salad. Oh, it's a like, cucumber yeah. salad. That's yummy. Lily, thank you for the sheesh. Sheesh. Sheeshes. I like... Do you like cucumber salad? Yeah, my mom makes it all the time. With onions. Nope, Load it up. No, she does it with uh, vinegar, magi, and then she squeezes it out. So Let's try that. Yeah. That and then our side. It is going to be warm coming up this week, so maybe we should go with maybe some like easier uh, cooling sides, like a potato salad. I do really like German potato salad, and we still have some of the new Warba potatoes, nice thin skin get those done okay thanks for the ideas friends that's gonna be a nice little german meal i think double tap will totally enjoy that and then this is also the meal where we're making the insane oreo cookie salad oreo cookie salad and look at what we got for them not just any oreo the mega stuff That's going to be a fun stream. German potato salad. I'll write the gherkin salad. Brackets. Cucumber salad. Done. And then Oreo. We got salads on salads <laughs> that day. You're in Arizona right now? Holita, if you're in Arizona, how is vacay going then? White Dove, can you make cannolis one day? White Dove. I heckin' love cannolis. That's another deep fried thing. You guys are seriously all over this. <laughs> <laughs> Out of control, the guys. best things are deep fried, though. Make chips once on stream. And they're like, okay, Kate can deep fry. <laughs> Let's see. I was thinking of doing a little bit of like an Italian style stream. I think I have a craving for caprese salad as well. It's tomato season. We'll go pick up some yummy matzah. Oh my gosh, Daph. I'm so sorry to hear that, my dude. Your pops passed away? Well, I won't worry now that you say that you're good, but... Our condolence is okay. I'm so sorry to hear that. It was his time. Word. Thank you for confirming that. Gavino, yeah. you've never heard of mega stuffed Oreos. We can probably chalk this up to a just a classic North American thing. I like to do it over the top here for whatever reason. Punisher just found a crazy sat. Apparently through Reddit, they say pancakes are the hardest to make. What? Who is saying this? Who is saying this? Pancakes are the hardest to make? I think this is lies. What kind of pancakes are they making even? Okay, so one day done. Thursday. Checking off a Pots and Pans redemption. Crushed. Now we need to do Friday next. Yeah, 8 p.m., 30C, and me in the sweater. I don't know why I put this on. It's just, like, the comfiest thing to wear. No it's, uh, it's only supposed to be, like, 22 today. So it's not, like, roasting yet. <laughs> that was the UK. Man, I would expect people in the UK to make some bomb pancakes. No problem. Was this in the Food Beginners subreddit? <laughs> Yoon is asking. <laughs> okay. Do we want to do the like Italian style stuff on Friday? Maybe. Maybe that's when we'll throw the shrimpers in. Grilled shrimps? Chili garlic grilled shrimp? Pizza again, Jay?
Yeah, that's nice, Daph. You're ca- being able to catch up with the fam. I mean, maybe not under the best circumstances, but at least you get a visit that way as well. Yeah, Mish, something with feta. Ooh, maybe like a pasta with feta in it? Greek pasta salad is always a really yummy Ooh. one to make. Are we having cravings right now? Is it a week of making Dude, salads? We're gonna have a Greek salad and some pork salaki? Well, we're doing pork the day before though. That doesn't bother me. What if we spread it out like <laughs> one day? We sure. can marinate the pork souvlaki on Friday and make it on Saturday. Yep. Because then we'll have the leftover pork shoulder from the schnitzel. Yep. I'm sure. Yep. Cottage pie. That's like, let's wait for that, Jay, until maybe fall time. I'm trying to not get into casserole mode just, just yet. Let's suck out as much summer as we can until the snow comes. <laughs> Once the snow comes, we'll do all the heavy dishes. <laughs> yeah, then we'll be packing it on for sure to stay warm. Shrimp Alfredo lasagna, my equal? Delicious. That sounds good. Pork every day, yo. Hello, Edward Knight. Greetings from Mipalo. What is your favorite food around the world and that you wish to taste? I mean, my favorite food around the world is pizza. I'm not picky about any specific variety of pizza. And what do I wish to taste, though? I would like to go to China and have some, like, legitimate dim sum. Hope that answers your question properly. Some quiche? Mish just made quiche last week. Shrimp scampi. Yes. That's complete white dove. I think I'll write that down maybe for next week. I don't want to do too much pasta either. If we're going to do a pasta salad. I don't know if I want to make some scampi the next day. And hi zinc. Welcome. Shrimp po boys. Hey. Hey, that's a good one. That could be a fun one for Sunday. That shouldn't be too long of a stream, I would say. Hi, Green Box Box. How are you? Welcome in. That's Sammy's mom, guys. Okay, so Friday we'll put at the bottom. Marinate. Souvlaki. And then Saturday, doing like a Greek plate. Pork souvlaki, we'll grill that up. That's the best way to make that for sure. On skewers. Yeah. Skewer it up. Pasta salad. Show you how to make that. That is like top for sure summertime meal prep thing. Mediterranean pasta salad. And it stays so good in the fridge. It almost gets better as it sits. Like maximum, I would say five days before the tomato and cucumber gets weird in it. And then, so that's like a combination of starch and veg. Do we need to make some sort of a dessert that day then? What are we feeling? Just go simple Saturday. And then the other thing that I'm going to check really quick is what we liked to do last week when we did this is as we went through the days, we also posted the recipes in Discord so that if anyone wanted to cook along with us, they could because the recipes were already there ahead of time. That's a good idea. Peanut butter cookies, maybe a strawberry shortcake. Tis the season, oh, right? Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> That's it. That's it. Strawberry shortcake. That's, that's my, a good idea that's my too. Dad's favorite. Daph is making some tzatziki cool you off in the hot desert. Yep. Yeah, I was wondering about that, Lily, right? A Greek dessert. Oh, 
We love those two things, Scotcheroo bars. Now I don't know what to make. There's too many good, <laughs> there's too many good suggestions. This is working the opposite way that I thought it would. <laughs> Mish Friday, you're making biscotti cheesecake? Do you gotta make the biscotti ahead of time for that? Okay, let me check this first. Discord. Recipes. Is there schnitzel? From last week. is not. Okay. Sammy said there was no recipe for the schnitzel though. I remember this now. Just buy the biscotti and then do the cheesecake. Okay, hold tight. I just have a quick bathroom break. Just gonna mute it for a sec. I'll be right back. We blame the coffee for this one, 100%. Okay, I'm back. Phew. We made it. Phew, phew. It's so cozy, guys. These chairs. Costco camping chairs. Winning. Okay, back to it. So we will first get the recipe. Let's find Jaeger schnitzel. I feel like this will be way easier to deal with. I know we'll kind of make our own schnitzel we'll show you guys how to do that proper but it's nice to be able to have a recipe maybe for the mushroom sauce hi Ernest how are you doing welcome in happy Monday okay lemon bugatza let's look this up white dove I'm gonna pop this up just so I don't get too far ahead oh what the heck is that This one's authentic. Five out of five, 39 reviews. The Daring Gourmet. Hunter schnitzel with mushroom gravy. I mean, probably be able to make it better than what they made. <laughs> Just going off of the photo. Or there's this one. Best Jaeger schnitzel made just like Oma. Probably that one? It doesn't look like that. It's just Hunter Sus. Yeah. Just want to make sure this is easy. No. How are we using pork leg? Like? No, that's not a good one to give them. Mm. 
Hello, Lazy Plague. How's everyone doing today? So far, so good. Just kind of getting the day started here. Looks like it's going to be a nice one outside. Or Cura Bietes, almond shortbread cookies. Hey, that's better. Thanks, Emma. That sounds good, too. We do have some almonds kicking around here. Taste of home. Not even a chance. The recipe says prepared brown gravy. That is not what we're doing here. Oh, that good. looks good. <laughs> Ready for the website I'm on? The Pudge Factor. <laughs> I'm in. I'm sold. Close this. Oh, Jaeger schnitzel was originally made with venison or wild boar. Imagine the wild boar. Holy smokes, that would be good. Peanut oil they fry it with. Okay, let's do that one. Copy. Yeah, the pudge factor. So there's that one, just posting that up quickly for us. That's gonna be Thursday coming up this week. Also just popped in Discord. That's one recipe. We still gotta get the, the cucumber salad. What did we call it? Gherkin salad. This one has so many reviews, 227 reviews. So it says cucumbers, a little bit of onion. We'll probably do just a touch of shallot, sour cream, sugar, vinegar, dill, parsley, a bit of paprika. That's going to be very refreshing. Could also say cooling. And I don't think we've ever made that before on stream even. I don't mind the creamy cucumber salad. I kind of grew up eating that on my mom's side because of the Polish and Ukrainian heritage. It's so good in the summer. And like, instead of the dried herbs, you should be able to use fresh, right? It's a staple in the company cafeterias. That's nice that you always have something kind of healthy to go with. Cause yeah, that's not really a thing here, Vune. Just like have the most basic of salad bars. I'm sure that's it. Okay, and then let me just check Discord really quick. I feel like we already have a German potato salad recipe that I like. Nope. Okay. Now we can find that as well. And if anyone knows of recipes or has recipe links that they know is are already delicious, feel free to share that in chat with us. I'm okay with this. Yeah, I've made it once, but I think I just did it from like Sam's mom's verbal directions. What's this one? Potatoes, bacon, onion, vinegar, sugar, mustard, salt, chives. It's close. It's close. I wasn't going to put the bacon. But it, that is traditional, isn't it? Oh. They really mushed up the potatoes, though. That one looks okay, Vyun. Okay, this one, authentic Bavarian recipe. That looks pretty good. They do a bit of beef stock. That's interesting. Potatoes boil semi-hard. Yeah, that's the same thing that Sam's mom does. Like semi-starchy. That's way too, that is way off. 
This is like a serious thing. <laughs> Let's see the Martha one. I'm always wary of Martha Stewart recipes. That one has the beef broth too. Okay, we'll just do that. That. Gotta get some bacon strips. It feels so weird though. I don't like using bacon unless it's ours, right? Need to get back on the bacon train. Okay, so those are all the recipes we needed for Thursday. Did you have any frozen? Frozen bacon? Where? The ham bacon? Oh, we might have some frozen ham bacon. It's not often used. Okay, that's what I thought. Like, your mom didn't typically put bacon inside of it either. Mm. She did eggs. Oh, okay. Sam cannot currently uh, remember. Normally had speck in it, to be honest, I think. Oh, that would be yummy. Oreo salad. Does this exist? Oreo fluff salad recipe. <laughs> yeah. Oreo fluff salad. Milk, pudding, whipped topping, Oreos. That is the most basic of it. Insane. There you go. All of them. Okay, thanks for your help, Bune, for the German recipes. That was awesome. Okay, next up, Friday. Are we feeling like some scrimps on Friday? I think that would be good. Little scrimpers. We'll get the Argentinian ones. Oh, wait, what about this? Shrimp ceviche. Could you make ceviche with those? You wouldn't. Man, I really want to make Fresh. ceviche though. Fresh. That's impossible to get here. Uh, no, but. Because, like, even the fresh ones at Costco are previously frozen. Costco, yes, but at a seafood supplier, no. You should okay. use your Cook with Kate ID to make yourself a fins account or something. Ah. Uh, thought we were doing a recipe for the schnitzel. I just linked that one because I thought it would be nice to let people know ahead of time what it is. Lily, but we can make our own recipe for the schnitzel for sure if that's what you want instead. Sammy's supposed to do it. Remember he said that last week? Do we remember this? Look, it's even right there. Call him out. <laughs> Hermit, I made myself a sad lunch. You would look upon me with shame if you witnessed this culinary travesty. What is it? <laughs> What is it? What did you make? It can't be that bad. Close, 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 close. Summer shrimp recipes. Can't just all be pasta. Shrimp and corn is yummy. Twenty scrimp dinners you'll want to make all summer long. Kebabs? We're doing kebabs that day. That looks weird. Nope. That looks weird. Nope. I'm not into zucchini noodles anymore. Nope. Testadas? Nope. Elote corn niblets. I know. We're gonna look for corn this week, Bonk. It's coming into our life. The scampi did sound good. 
I mean, I guess it's not a bad thing if we do pasta twice. Scampi it is. Scrimp and rice is nice too, though. Scampi. And then the next day we're doing Mediterranean pasta salad. Finn's gonna die. Avocado and shrimp chopped salad. That's not very filling. Do a little shrimp or boil? No, do a cob salad with shrimp. Instead of chicken. Oh. Want to make a cob salad? Put feta instead of blue cheese? Yep. We're making our own cob salad. It's coming up. Health reasons. Okay. This is Hermit's lunch. I just threw a potato in the air fryer and some poorly seasoned chicken. Didn't even go all out. In my defense, I am meal prepping on mass. Regardless, it's a sad state of affairs here. I would be ousted from this stream if you saw it. Why are you doing it that way? Put a little bit more love into it. <laughs> Instead of poorly seasoned chicken, just have properly seasoned chicken. You already know what you're doing wrong. That's gonna be a sheesh from me. But I do appreciate being told about the sad travesty of the situation. You're even sadder now after eating the food than you were before? Yeah, that can't be right. Something's wrong there. Something's a bit off. Okay, Friday, getting some salad into our life. Cobb salad. So that has, we'll use the bacon in the cob salad rather than the potato salad the day before. So greens. This is also a salad that they teach you how to make in culinary school and you get tested on it, like all the components of it. <laughs> yeah, acknowledging you have a problem, first step to recovery usually. So greens, we'll do our shrimp, bacon, there's tomato, usually corn we can say. View this recipe, they make a Dijon dressing. It's quite a nice looking one. Here, check it out. Check it out, friends. Say we've replaced chicken with shrimp in this delicious and easy spin on the classic cob. Satisfying salad just takes 20 minutes to make. Oh, nice and short stream then. 20 minutes, done and done. So greens, shrimp, tomato. They do cucumbers in there. I guess that's good. They switched out corn for cucumber. We do boiled eggs. Egg, pop some feta in there because I don't know how the blue cheese is gonna go with the shrimp, not really my style. I'm a bachelor, I have yet to have had the civilizing effect of a wife so I still eat over the sink like an animal. <laughs> You're hilarious, Hermit. One thing we can't forget on this salad is avocado. That was so good with shrimp. Feta and then our dressing. Which you can go like one of two ways with cob dressing. I do have a little bit of, I think, leftover creamy herb dressing in the fridge. Almost like a ranch style. I'll check that out, see if that's A-OK, -okay, because then we can use the rest of that up, or we'll make our own dressing for the salad. Hey, that is true as well, Bond. Yeah, if you're wondering why you're still a bachelor, got a little fluff tickle here. Might be because maybe you haven't upped your cooking skills, but some people just don't give a heck, really. Okay, so Friday, our cob salad. Let's post that up in Discord for us as well. We'll make our own dressing. The dressing that they put with the recipe there sounds really good too. It's like 
Dijon, some shallots, stuff like that. I think Finn is in the front room, if you're wondering <laughs> what the noise was. Okay, so another day done. And then we already kind of skipped ahead to Saturday. We're going to do a Greek, a Greek little platter homemade pork souvlaki that will marinate the day ahead. Mediterranean pasta salad. I don't think I have recipes for either of those. Could be wrong though. Oh, I do. I always use actually the Serious Eats. It's the chicken souvlaki with the pitas and the tzatziki. And then I just switch out whether I want chicken or pork. I'm sure you could do beef as well would be good. Heck, maybe even shrimp souvlaki if you want to try it. So that's already on Discord. Exactly what you had at the restaurant in Vegas, Bonk was like that platter plus all of your dips that looked so good the pita and dip platter so so good but we're gonna switch out instead of doing pita with the souvlaki we'll do a pasta salad and then now we're working on the dessert A Greek dessert the four dip appetizer and yeah I just love eating with my hands too right we've done baklava before so I don't really want to make that again we still have leftover hazelnuts from last week if we want to use those up in anything So good. Greek style apple pie. The Kurabietes are the crisp and buttery shortbread covered in icing sugar. Hello, potent peach. Where's the kitchen? Oh, we're just doing menu planning today. So we are out of the kitchen currently. We will be back in there on Thursday coming up. Have no fear. The kitchen is still here. It's just outside. You miss the pots and the pans. I don't know. I'm not really sold on any of these desserts. Fuck. <laughs> Should we make some Reese's mini Reese cup peanut butter cookies? Sure. Or we do the cannoli that day. Even make your own dough for the shells. Flour, sugar, salt, butter, egg yolk, and white wine. There's white wine in the cannoli shell. Okay. And then you roll it out, cut it into quarters. It 
interesting. But we need a cannoli mold, it says. What? Has anyone in chat made cannolis before? I don't know if I'm down for that yet. I might have to save that for next week. One thing that I do have in the fridge to use up is some lemon. So let's make a lemon dessert that will have some Greekness to it. Mish hasn't. Layered lemon dessert. Yeah, they're just tubes. I was thinking like maybe you just use, well, you have to fry it on the tubes though, pretty sure, Lily, is the ish. You fry the shells on the tubes, unless there's another way to do it. Let's see the all recipes one, what they say. Yeah, roll it around the tubes, sealing the edge with egg white. Fry the shells on the tubes, so you can't just like use a plastic thing, you need the legitimate if I made that, yeah, if I made the Paris breast, you can do anything. Thanks, Mish. What about a fruit salad with a lemon dressing, Mighty Quill? That would be yummy, too. I've never really made anything like that before. Is that like a UK style of thing to have? Lemon pound cake. Lemon cupcakes, lemon bars, mini lemon ring pies, citrus butter cookies, blueberry lemon sweet rolls, creamy lemon crumb squares? A mix between a coffee cake and a lemon bar? That looks interesting. What do people say here? All of the scrolling. Holy smokes. Very crumbly is what people are saying about this one. Maybe not. Are we doing the laundry? Is that what you're hearing in the background? Sam's playing a game and then there's a fan here, Amp Sand. Is that what you're hearing? I mean, there, there, is, is, there is laundry going, but I didn't think you could hear it. A squash cake with coconut and lime. That, Mish, you should post in Discord. We'll make it closer to the fall when it's squash season. When they're popping. Oh, that sounds good. Strawberry lemon bars. I've never done that before, but I love that idea of a combo. Totally switched it up. Done. Donezo. We've, we've settled on it. Those look so yummy and summery. Hopefully we can find some fresh strawberries at the market. Very simple ingredients too. Strawberry lemon bars. So that's Saturday. Grilled pork souvlaki on the skewer. Mediterranean pasta salad. And to fill it in, because we need dessert in our life, strawberry lemon squares. Okay, sweet. Now you just have to figure out quick and easy Sunday. think it would be easy enough, Lily, to just do DIY tubes instead of buying them? How would you DIY those, though? You would need, like, a metal bender or something like that. 
I got nothing. I'm thinking Sunday, we've not done like a brunch or breakfast style stream in a bit. And I like to do that every couple of Sundays. If anyone has any breakfast things, I know someone mentioned quiche earlier. But Sammy's not the biggest fan of scrambled eggies. So I try and only give him quiche a couple times a year. That's it. <laughs> Summer breakfast recipes? French toast quill. Oh! Like making our own bread and everything? That would be fun. But French toast is better if you have day old bread. Let's be honest here. Because then it soaks up better. Rando and Finn might have an idea. They just like to eat food. <laughs> they don't really care what we feed them. Sometimes they have an idea, but usually when we ask, they just get nervous and don't know what to say. So I've stopped putting the pressure on them in that way, Lily. It was a bit too much, you can say. Okay, breakfast. Mish, Mish with the brunch pizza. Wanna do like a skillet pizza? Brunch pizza is really good. I usually do like bacon, egg, avocado on there is really good. Go like Southwest style. Nothing too crazy healthy either. Like so much breakfast recipes now are just like health food. Like not everyone does meal prep all the time. Whoa. And you Lunique had a tweet this morning about a spicy egg and sausage sandwich. Ooh, I do love breakfast sandwiches. We can do homemade English muffins and do breakfast sandwich, polenta fries. I'm gonna say I should go look at the tweet. Not really been on Twitter yet this morning, but let's go creep. Good one, Ampsand. Good one. Searching. Where's the search? Oh, there we go. Oh. <laughs> Hala friend or fennel sausage and egg sandwich. Looks pretty delish. I think we could even make it better. Breakfast. sandwich recipes. You can really go crazy with it, can't we? That's what I was looking at, White Dove, but you know how we feel about croissants here. I mean, we could always just buy the croissants. That's okay. It's so good, right? Especially when they're toasted because then they just crunch and crisp right on up. Give you good texture. Chili Rienos crop, madame. Open-faced prosciutto egg. Cheeseburger omelet sliders.
I mean, we have bacon twice already on the other two days of the week, so let's not do bacon, right? Monte Cristo, that is so good, Chase. I do love ham and cheeses. Idea, Lily says, when you end up making the cannoli, just make tubes out of aluminum foil. <laughs> that would work as well, right? But honestly, if I was going to make cannoli, I would just buy the tubes. Save myself. Personally, I don't have a ton of time outside of things that I do for stream, so I wouldn't take the time to make them. And hopefully they're not that expensive. Problem is because Sean says a sandwich bread is that they usually aren't big enough for a proper one. Yep. <laughs> Punk. Solving problems. That's why you make and consume two amp sand. <laughs> Croissant breakfast sandwich. So should we make a croissant croque madame? Or the Monte Cristo even? I really am hesitant when I see a recipe that says how to make the perfect croissant crisp or a croque madame. How do you know that this is the perfect one? LA and I should write an article on this. They're saying already, this is going to be the fanciest ham and cheese sandwich you'll ever have. So we make a bechamel. That'll be fun on a Sunday. Don't you dare tease me with a Monte Cristo. Okay, why? Three people have said Monte Cristo. Am I changing this up? <laughs> Let's search croissant Monte Cristo. Oh, they do a baked casserole version. The recipe critic. That actually looks so good. Wait, there's jam in it? Bonk is saying there's jam in it too. Is this new? Is this new? Hi, Ron. Welcome back. I had no idea there was raspberry jam in a Monte Cristo. Nope. How about something with scrambled eggs? This guy right here hates them. But we can. I don't mind scrambled eggs as long as there's enough cheese inside of them. Oh, jam on the side to dip. Because this recipe I just brought up had a layer of the raspberry jam inside. And I was like, whoa. Was not expecting that. Ham and cheese melt on a pretzel roll, White Dove is saying. Yeah. You're making me hungry. Okay, so no to the one with jam inside. So far, I'm thinking this is it. Check this one out. Cheese is the best. Cheese, probably one of my favorite ingredients ever. Yeah, this is straight up comfort food. I'm posting on Discord whether we make it or not. It actually looks really delicious though. So they do the croissant, mustard, ham, gruyere, parm. So we got the gruyere and parm already. Just need the ham. Fried eggs, chives, and then you top it with your bechamel. And then they just did like a simple salad on this side with frisee. Basically all we do, stuff the ham and cheese inside the croissant, bake that, and then you make your bechamel and egg. There's too much traffic on it right now, Bonk, after I posted it. We broke the server for the site. <laughs> I mean, I will say though that foodnetwork.ca, one of the slowest sites ever. One of the slowest ever. Let 
Ron just popped on. Or he just jumped on and started popping off. Okay. So Costco croissants coming up then this week? Croissants for the people. Maybe we can give Valkyrie and her husband some breakfast croissant. Croissant croc madame. Rainbow pants. <laughs> That's gonna be a fun one to say too. Croissant croc madame. And then what do we want on the side of it? Maybe instead of going like savory, we can just do like a, the fruit salad there. That'll be a nice, simple, easy one. Hey, White Dove. So tasty. Let's do a fruit salad because all of the summer fruits are popping right now. And that's quite yummy. Peach, maybe apricot, plum, throw a couple berries in there. Good to go. Have that afterwards. Not nearly been eating enough fruit in my life. Okay, well that was easy. Let's see if we can find a summer fruit salad. Also want to say like that peach salad that we did with the feta and hazelnuts was really delicious very satisfying would easily go for that again too yeah that's a good idea Amsan save some of the lemons we have a bunch so we should have some left over make a lemon dressing to pour on the salad Oh yeah, Ron, peppers are in season, hey? We can, I mean, we could always put a little bit of roasted jalapeno in some of the croc madams, spice up our life that way. That could be yummies. Okay, perfect summer fruit salad. Oh, they even snuck kiwi in there. I mean, pineapple, kiwi, and banana is not really a seasonal local thing here. So I'm going to try to not use those or rely on it. That's why I was like peach, apricot, plum, pear, apple, any type of berry you can think of. Try and leave out like the grape, pineapple, banana, stuff like that, that you can get year round and is probably not as delicious right now. Silly people, they just don't even know. Okay, well there's the there's the menu for the week. Hi Mary, welcome in. Happy Monday to you. That didn't take long at all. One hour. One hour that took us to do the menu. We crushed it this week. We still have to do the grocery list, so don't worry about that. And then after this, we'll get into some games I'm thinking. Okay, so Thursday, we're doing a 75k pots and pans for Double Tap 1, who saved those up just watching the stream, the Twitch channel points. And they want us to make Jaeger schnitzel, which is a typical schnitzel pounded out pork cutlet that is breaded and fried. And it's served with a creamy mushroom sauce decided to do a German potato salad with that and then a traditional cucumber salad called gherkin salad from Germany as well and then double tap asked if we can do a very simple dessert called Oreo cookie salad. Oreos crushed up, vanilla pudding, and whipped cream. <laughs> Maybe we'll make like a little bit of chocolate ganache or something to drizzle over. We'll see. We'll see. Friday going down, going to have a little bit of a healthier stream, we can say. So a cog salad. We were informed yesterday that we've not had nearly enough shrimp in our life recently. So we're doing cog salad with shrimp. Greens, shrimp, bacon, tomato, cucumber, boiled eggs, 
feta, avocado, and we'll do a homemade dressing to go with that. And then we'll also prep ourselves Friday for Saturday. So we'll marinate all of the pork souvlaki that day. So it gets really tasty overnight in the fridge. And thank you, Rong. Yeah, don't be so sorry. It's okay. And thank you for the 500 bitties as well going towards our food truck fund. <laughs> you don't need to be popping off. You're here to learn. Hey, I appreciate the popping off. That's a okay. Okay, next up, Saturday, going down our Greek day. So pork souvlaki, recipes are already in Discord for you for that. Pre-marinated ahead Friday night, and then Mediterranean pasta salad, and gotta use up some lemons in the fridge. So strawberry lemon squares, nom. Why not? Not too sweet, very refreshing with the lemon in the summer. And then, as always, our simple, easy Sunday stream. We're going brunch style this week. Croissant croc madams. Mary, ooh. <laughs> ooh. Croissant croc madams going with just a simple summer fruit salad. Croc madam will be learning a mother sauce that day. Bechamel, so good. Hey, Mish. Thanks for the nice reminder. That's something that I've wanted to do as well lately. I've never gone to donate blood either. Why? Why is that a thing? That should be like a more regular thing, right? Save people's lives. Good for you as well, Mish. I've heard nothing but positive things from people that go and donate blood on the reg and you always get schnappas too. A little bit of fruit juice chippies yeah figured why not oh yeah you work at the hospital even come on she says okay so going through this list schnitzel we need some pork shoulder in our life to make that we'll slice off the pork shoulder into steaks and then pound out from there to get it nice and thin and then we'll also use the remaining pork shoulder from that to make the souvlaki for Saturday. Lily, you wish you could donate your blood, but they don't want it. Oof, yeah, some, not everyone can donate. I do know that. Okay, pork shoulder. We already have the panko crumbs for the schnitzel breading, which is important. And then you'll just need for helping the breadcrumbs to stick. Usually it's a mixture of eggs and milk. I will put milk on the list times two. We'll need that. Side German potato salad. We have enough potatoes for that. I'll put eggs on the list too because we'll probably go through a bunch of those coming up. Don't want to run out. So we got the boiled eggs in the potato salad. Boiled eggs in the cob salad. <laughs> so many eggs eggs in the lemon squares and eggs on Sunday. We are not against eggs here. Let us be known. We even have three or two large green ones. <laughs> eggs are going on the list. Uh, I do have russet potatoes Ron, but I was going to make the German potato salad with the rest of our war buzz, which are a like white fleshed new potato, which is really good. And that way we can leave the skin on extra nutrients. So yes, we have the potatoes. We need the eggs. I will write either chive, probably green onion instead. Maybe we can get that even from the farmer's market. And then let's see what else if I'm missing anything. Let's go to discord. This week, yeah, green eggs and ham. Potato, salt, cider vinegar, sugar, bacon, onion, beef broth, parsley. We got the parsley already. I usually don't do the beef broth, but you can. And then let's just put 
white onion as well. If you don't have any more of that. And then the gherkin salad. So cucumber we have, got that to use up. We want some fresh dill in our life for sure. That's gonna be good, Mary. Yeah, if you've checked out the recipe for those strawberry lemon bars, I think that's gonna be super tasty. Okay, recipes for day one, complete. Cobb salad, greens on the list. Shrimp. The Belgian Grand Prix. Shrimp a -ruse. We should have bacon yet, or are still in the freezer, our ham bacon, so should be good to go for that. Just signed up for Discord. Can you post your name? Here you go. Here's the invite link. Click on that, join it up. We got a very nice large community there, over 500 members now. She's growing every single week. Spreading the deliciousness. That's the place to do it. Okay, we got tomatoes still for that. Might need extra cucumber. Yes, we will. Heavy cucumber week as well. Cucumber salad Thursday, cucumber in the salad on Friday, and cucumber on the salad on Saturday. Insane. Healthy week coming up. Those are gonna be fit and looser. Got the feta, avocado, for sure needed. And then the dressing. Oh, and the Oreo cookie salad. <laughs> Do not forget the cookie salad. Yes, thank you, Ron. Thanks for joining. Feel free to check out all of the channels in our Discord. It is pretty massive now, the things that we're able to share there. And then we also have a little section to stay updated on our truck through my brother's stream, Rando Chrome. So check that out too. Pretty sure we're gonna go raid him today when we're done here because he's starting to work on the truck. Get some more content for the YouTube as well. Okay, Saturday. So pork souvlaki, we already have our pork shoulder on the list for the meat. And then souvlaki marinade. I might have to even add lemon onto the list because there's lemon in the marinade, garlic, dried oregano, usually red wine vinegar. Sometimes I sneak a bit of feta into the marinade as well. And we'll make a tzatziki with that too, I think. To go with that. It's so yummy for dipping. Yeah, feta for sure, Mish. Feta in the cob salad and feta in the Mediterranean pasta salad. All of the fetas. Yeah, we do eat that in Canada, Ron. We have made that actually pretty recently the sausage gravy and biscuits. It's so good. We usually do that on a Sunday for brunch and then put a fried egg on top. It's delish. So we have the yogurt. Dill's on the list for the tzatziki. We got cucumber on there. Okay, good to go there. Yeah, very healthy. <laughs> One of the farthest things from health. Stick to your ribs good. Man. Okay, that is that. Our pasta salad. So we already have the pasta. Should we reactivate it? I mean, we can. We can bonk. I'll quickly go do that. You can still complain. But 
But I mean, we've been using a lot of feta lately, so... I don't know if those complaints are even valid. <laughs> yeah, since we have some. I will complain, yeah, over the lack of feta right now, Misha's saying. <laughs> One thing I didn't do was the, the recipe for the Mediterranean pasta salad. Usually I don't use a recipe, I just make it. See if there's a serious eats one. Nope. Have I ever made chipped beef? Never white dove. I know that is an American thing as well, right? But I've never made chipped beef. I remember having to Google this. A form of pressed, salted, and dried beef. I honestly don't even know if we can get that here. Also known as the SOS, right, right, Bonk. I remember this talk, it's coming back. Yeah, creamed chipped beef is a breakfast staple in Northeastern United States. Sammy! <laughs> <laughs> Beside, you can't see. He says no, guys. Please. Please. Yeah, I have never seen anything like this here. <laughs> Heading out around dog to walk. He doesn't even have a watch yet, but he knows the time. He knows time. What kind of dog do you have, by the way? I'm intrigued by this. We love doggos here. Feel free to post a picture in Discord too, in the pet section if you want. Okay, cooking with Mima Mediterranean pasta salad. That looks pretty legitimate. Oh, we gotta get some Kalamata olives in our life, I think. Do you hear my stomach? We're not okay. Scrolling. Okay, they do rotini pasta, cherry tomato, olive, marinated artichoke is actually really yummy in there. Bell pepper is good as well. Let's not forget that. So we can do canned artichoke. 16 year old schnauzer. A 16 year old schnauzer? Aww, that's so cute. Good for you taking care of them. And they're like pretty old, pretty old doggo. Been with you for a while. <laughs> Bonk, this sounds so good. Salty dried preserved thin sliced beef paired with a bland white cream sauce on toasted bread. Mary, you're gonna shop for the lemon strawberry and try to make it, yes, yes. Mary's gonna be cooking with cake coming up. Okay, artichoke for the pasta salad, bell. Oh, I think I actually still have a little bit of sweet peppers in the fridge. Don't even need that on the list. Yes, clear it out. So we got the bell pepper. We got our tomato already. We got the feta. We'll have our Kind of extra souvlaki marinade can be used as the salad dressing for the pasta salad if you reserve some. Pro tip there. We have parsley. I don't mind adding a bit of basil. Just we need to make sure that we use it up. Because basil does not last long in the fridge. And they actually did mozzarella cheese in the Mediterranean salad instead of feta. That's kind of silly. That's a bit silly. Okay, there's that. So Saturday list. Strawberry lemon squares is next.
We got butter. We got sugar. Vanilla, salt, flour. A whole cup of lemon juice, but four lemons. Oh, they do. How come it looks like they did full on strawberries, like fresh? But then they call for strawberry jam in the filling. Are they lying to us, Mary? Okay, she just did dollops of the jam, I guess. Yeah, pour the filling over the warm crust and add dollops of strawberry jam throughout. Well, we have raspberry. Oh no, we do have both. We have a strawberry and a raspberry jam. So that's chiggity checked then. That's easy. And then we can save all of our fresh fruit for Sunday for the fruit salad. I'm just going to put summer fruit on the list because then we can check and just buy whatever looks the best at the moment. Hopefully all from the market too. Hopefully the BC Okanagan fruit person is there again this week. And then our croissant croc madame. So let's not forget we need croissants for that. That'll definitely save us a lot of time. Otherwise, if we make the croissants, that'll take like two days ahead of time. Did I see Alton's recipe for smoked meatloaf? Misha's asking. I've not. I have not. I've seen recently Maddie Matheson's. I know it's almost meatloaf time again. Going into fall time. Best thing I ever made, Alton says, smoked meatloaf. They call it smoked party meatloaf. <laughs> it's a party. Okay, so for the croc madame, we're going to need some ham. Already got the gruyere for the filling. We can make our bechamel, which is like a milk-based cream sauce with roux so flour and butter get extra milk for that and then we have our eggs on the list too so that's actually quite a small grocery list for the week we did really good on menu planning and making sure that a lot of the ingredients that we use are used throughout all four days so we're not just like jamming the fridge with a bunch of one-off things Mary, you did the fried chicken last night. You forgot the egg for the marinade. Totally worked out though. The like crispy Chinese fried chicken. The Chinese chicken wings. Is that the one you're talking about? That sounds so good. Okay, so then the next thing I always do is Lost some of this. Sam and I use a grocery store app called Bring or like a grocery list app. Let me find it here. It might be in a different spot. Food. So that's what it looks like. And so you just pop up what you want to use it syncs between both people so I can see if he adds something new to the list or he can see if Sam is going shopping and I add something it basically updates right away and he's like oh Kate needs that still the recent fried chicken Mary Mary did we just do buttermilk fried I don't even remember what we made Okay, so then we go off of the list that we wrote out and we'll add all of the things onto the list. Pork shoulder, already there from last week. Two milks, check. Eggs. Green onion. White onion. Dill, 
greens, shrimp -a -roos. Oh, I spelt that wrong. Cucumber. What? Alton's rhyme Your turkey. Stomach. Yeah, don't even listen it's to hilarious. it. It's hilarious. I've already rah, eaten rah, today. Rah, 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 rah. I've had peach. I've had some of the carrot orange juice. <laughs> <coughs> I don't even know what to do right now, Sam. Did you hear it, Mish? Alton's bread and turkey was the first recipe you ever did. And every time it comes out perfect. I think I've done that one before too, Mary, and it works really good. Okay, buttermilk fried chicken is so easy and also very delicious. I'm happy you tried it. I'm sure it still worked great, even without the egg. I don't even recall putting the egg in. Oreo. Lemon. Artichoke hearts. Basil. I already had summer fruit on there. Croissant. Ham. Done. Very inexpensive week. Close it up. Now you can have fun. Sometimes your stomach growls if you just ate a big meal. It's been a bit since I ate. It is almost lunchtime soon after stream today for sure. Get the burrito if you want to eat the burrito. A burrito snack? Yesterday we ordered some mucho burrito. We were like, that's kind of the healthiest option we had. It was actually, it was okay. Not the best burrito. But it was, it worked. It worked for what it was. I think you can, when you watch them make your burrito, you have more. I was going to say, probably if you get your burrito delivered, they don't put as much love in it because you're not watching them make it the whole time. Correct. There's no pressure. Yeah. They don't, they can't put a face to the burrito that they're making. <laughs> <laughs> well, we've seen those same people all the time in Langford, so they got to know us, I guess. Okay. Okay, guys, we're going to play a little bit of Animal Crossing just to finish up today. Is Yeah, I'm just finishing up a couple more hours that I needed for the month for Twitch behind the scenes. And then we're A-OK. -okay. Restart a new month. And then we also have some exciting things coming up for September. I know that a lot of food streamers are doing streaming for Starlight or streaming for charity in September, which is absolutely amazing. I haven't decided yet if I want to contribute or not but what we are going to be doing is a giveaway going on so there's going to be three prizes and kind of tying it into twitch's September that they always do in September so it gives people a chance to subscribe to the stream for a lower price welcome in some new people to the community that way and one of the main prizes that we're going to be giving away is this a Lego set. Everyone is awesome. It originally came out for Pride Month and we ended up buying two, one for me to have and build and then one to give away in September like we planned. It's completely sealed. Yeah, it's completely sealed up, A-OK -okay in there. Brand new set in the box. So you don't even have to build it if you don't want to. You can just leave it in there as like a collector's thing. Okay, I'm just going to take a really quick bathroom break and then we'll get switched with our gaming here. Switch with our Switch? Yeah, we'll switch over to Switch Gaming. And then have a chill rest of our Monday before we go see what's going on with the truck. No Lego for Sammy. He needs to get the stove going. <laughs> You're right, Ernest. Yeah, call him out. <laughs> That's enough play time for you, Sama. Okay, hold tight.
Twitch music. So that's all good. Hi, I'm back. Yeah, it should be all good. Should be all good? Yeah, do something. Then I can see if this goes up or not. Oh. Yeah. It did. It's good. Okay, so we'll turn that down just a touch then. I'm thinking. Sam, can you get to gaming on the phone? What you mean, Mary? Now we can get comfy. And I'm just gonna switch the title really quick on Twitch and what we're doing. Cause we ain't food and drinking anymore. Just peachin? Just peachy? Just peachy? Yeah, because we gotta go get peaches. Done. Yeah. Okay. Yahoo! How is the game audio compared to my voice? It's pretty high, I feel. There we go. Hey, thank you. The Chromebook is sticking to Android and you don't know how to do games yet. A Chromebook, is that like a Google tablet? I don't think you can do anything after that. I think Chromebook just runs on Android. Unless you can format it and put Windows on it. Can you put Windows on it? Let's begin. Well, you just want me to get into gaming on the phone so you have something to play with? <laughs> I play Hearthstone on my phone a lot. Also, if anyone oh, else God. plays this game, feel free to come for a visit to my island or we can go back and forth. Just let me know in chat. Hmm. That is A-OK. -okay. I think the phone audio is just a bit delayed. Just gonna watch, okay. So I was, um roaming around already this morning a bit on animal cross and this was my outfit that i i made for us first thing but i think we'll go and change it now that it, we're playing together that's my little house for anyone that missed our our stream last wednesday playing this I'm wicked. I don't know what's happening. I got my other. I'm gonna change the roller coaster to the train sets. Nice. Yeah. Okay, you guys, what should we wear? Feeling crazy meme shirt today? Or should I match what I'm wearing? The color. <laughs> I did pick this up yesterday. I know that I have a samurai helmet. Let's <laughs> go. <laughs> we need some tights or something. I think I'm going to start playing Hades on stream. I wouldn't mess with that. You love it, guys? Good. Sammy's gonna play some Hades? Yeah. 
Let's go really colorful tights. Or go like with those. Whoa. Pink flowers. No, the yellow. Yellow? Yeah. Goes with the one band of yellow that you got right there. There's a band of yellow? Oh. There is. Because that just looks funny, right? Okay, we're going crazy style. Complete. Let's roll. <laughs> Look how big the helmet is. <laughs> And I don't think there's anything really new since last time we were here. But yeah, if you want to see the host, just ask. We can do our tour again. Haven't really changed anything since last week, though. And we are still looking for peaches. We pretty much have empty pockets already, so it might be a smart thing to just go buy a ticket. and go island hopping. I know we've had offers to go get peaches from someone else's island, but we're gonna try and do it on our own. going flying today. I don't know why the peaches keep just evading me. I don't understand, chat. Let's also just go sell these couple of things and away we go. So you really want to go to the island with as little in your pockets as possible so you can leave with as much from there and make some money that way. That, we can do that. I think we'll hold on to the summer shells. Just organize that. Let's roll. At a crossroads. Watch out, friendos. We're going to Dodo Airlines. We want to fly. Roger that. We're using our ticket. Are we ready, chat? I would say we're ready. We got all our tools. We got lots of materials to build tools if we break them. Got a walker who needs wings. What would dodos do, Sammy? Dodos are extinct now? Yeah, it took like a year or something. He was killed within like the first time they went on the island. Oh, okay. They're like, look, birds that can't fly. Let's kill them all. Dead. Good what job, humans. Heck? 
<laughs> okay, they evaded us once again, but I mean, we do have a lot of pears, so we'll probably get some pear... Pear game? Pear recipes. We're pear gaming. <laughs> kind of a letdown, but it's okay. At least it's not apples, honestly. So now we just have to basically pillage the island of all the materials. Otherwise, we waste the nook miles and just go back, right? Up to you. But I usually take advantage of all this stuff so we can go craft and make some money. Clean up all the weeds. I don't usually take the flowers unless it's something different. Because when you pick the flower, it takes up one entire space. They don't just compile the same way that the weeds do. in a bottle. What do we got? I was out doing whatever I like to do. None of your business and who cares? Got this cool DIY idea and then I thought where's the fun in keeping the recipe to myself? You've got this. I believe in you. This is what Paula gives to us. Dark wooden mosaic wall. This is new. Sweet. Probably be able to craft that when we get back. Okay, let's keep going this way. Maybe we'll find some new fishes today. Actually one of the most relaxing games I've ever played. I hear that a lot from everyone else that plays this game, too. These are so cool. Zebra turkey fish. Hey, Nakurbis, how are you? What's up here? So I got my rope claimed. Oh, heck yeah. Boba in our life? Sammy's saying we got some boba. I had a craving for boba since like early this morning. Okay. Got a fossil. It's located inside the TNT on 137. The boba? Yeah, the, the dream tea. So we don't have to go downtown to West Ed. Hey. That's on the way to St. Albert anyways. Okay, we might as well finish off all the other stuff up here since we're here. gold. Just iron and clay. Just the flu. What? Just was, the flu? That's all. Okay, I think you have to shop anyway, so... Yeah, still the other variants can if happen. If you wouldn't get it, you wouldn't get oh. it that bad anyway. Right. Alright, just the flu. Just the flu. Oh, yeah. Thank you. <laughs> Say hi to everyone. Stream. We're streaming. You're streaming still? Yeah. <laughs> what are you streaming? Caitlin's playing games. Games. Oh, games. Okay, I just looked at me. I didn't see you. She's down at the bottom of the corner. Yeah. 
Yeah, pull your nose. You messed up the animal. Pardon? You messed up the animal. She's still there, yeah? We haven't stopped? But that, but that is cooked. Nope. Not okay, Mondays. Well, today we did our menu planning, and then... I know, I see that. Yeah. But after that, she was gone. No, it just switches to the other thing. We never stopped. Oh, I could find out. So like, oh, she's done, it's now a call. No, just look That's quick fine. with Kate, and we'll be on. Okay. All okay. right. Okay. So you go. Okay. Bye. Bye. Say bye, everyone, too, then. Yeah, broadcast live around the world. <laughs> I mean, hey, they picked up Hitch and got drunk with him, so there's that too. And I was like, Mom, show Hitch the, the schnapps. Oh, they had some schnapps. Show Hitch the schnapps drawer just once. <laughs> My folks are awesome. Thank you very much. Yeah, the schnapps drawer bonk. I've not even been shown this. Well, you've been shown the schnapps drawer. You just never went into it. I never partook because it wasn't offered. Oh, it's always offered. When the drawer you is open. You gotta ask? No, the drawer is open. Oh, you, no. you just go in there. That's it for my stone axe. We gotta build another one. You broke it on the coconut tree. I have no idea if Hitch has that clip still or not. It was funny. Did we get all that wood from us? Yep. Okay, let's make another one first. We'll finish over here. Catching bees and chopping trees. That's the <laughs> situation under control <laughs> <laughs> oh shit go 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 why do you still make stone axes Why not? I'll just make the hardcore one. You can use the other axe on, on, on stone. The stone? Yeah. No. Yeah. It's fine. Does it not break it? No. Well, it'll all break eventually. Like hey. It always does. The more you know. But yeah. I don't know. That's probably OCD right there. <laughs> I can't use an iron axe on the stone. Why would you do that, Sam? <laughs> now <Wait>. look. <laughs> you said it. <laughs> so should I use the stone axe on the tree now? You are, yeah. Just roll with it? Yeah. To Reno! Two years! What a legend. Two year resub, part of the kitchen crew. We need some hypes in chat indeed. How is my fellow Canadian doing? Happy Monday, friend.
should be a gold star on the VIP. Can we do that? No. Bonk. <laughs> we'll, we'll send a message. Let's, let's write a letter. We will compose a letter stating what we want. I know, I was just thinking, I was like, okay, we don't really have another incentive. Just got out of bed, didn't want to get up, but you have coffee. Yeah, today was a double shot of caffeine day, I told Rando. I would like to switch up my usual coffee order for a double today, please. It was for good measure. Yeah, deluxe VIP badge, or just even being able to like change the color of it would be cool. Levels of VIP, right? Okay, we'll compose this letter. <laughs> Police are coming right up. Yeah, Rando's stream is starting real soon here. Pretty sure. Nope. Not yet? Sam says not yet. No, it's not gonna happen today. Oh, today's not the day then. Nope. We lied. It's a lie. I guess we didn't have all the parts then. Oh, this was a good iron rock. Yeah, the cool sibling, you know it. <laughs> oh, the double shot was the beer for breakfast. <laughs> this island almost had like nothing. We barely even filled up our pockets. Might have to have a peach sour beer later on today when it gets warm. Mighty Quill, you love Animal Crossing? I love it so much. It's like basically the only game I play. And I don't even feel like I'm that good at it. It's just so easy to like pick up and put down all the time. It's not a huge commitment if you don't want it to be. You have it too? Well, if you ever want to come visit, let me know. I'm okay with this. Torino, your brother left for Ontario this morning to see your younger brother and family. Just you and your son there now. Now you can clean without it getting messy in a day again. Winning. Get a finch. Fishing. Samurai. What do we got? Nice one. Puffer fish. We had this chat last time. Would you guys eat puffer fish like in Asia if it was properly prepared? Would you take the risk? What's with all the zebra turk fishes? No cameras? Yeah, fugu? I think it's just F-U-G-U. -U. Bonk is saying no? Okay, we got a shark here. Oh, there goes the grasshopper. Grasshopper went into the water? Whoa. Tiger shark? <coughs> what? Oh shit! Moonfish! Oh, what? Sunfish. Sunfish! Is that because you called it moonfish yes. last time? Yeah. Oh, no! <coughs> Nakurbis, you saw a puffer fish in the waters in Hawaii where you just like, swim away! Swim! Well, they puff up when they get angry. Oh, okay. Or scared. Oh, yeah. Pretty sure you put worse things in your mouth, Torino? I mean, yeah, it's like I would want to try it. <laughs> What? Fishing pole right through the samurai helmet. Oh. <laughs> yeah. 
Dolphins use puffer fish to get high? Yep. And they pass it around. <laughs> A tire? A tire. Boots, tires, and cars? Okay, we have pillaged all of the pears on the island. EXBC Esco and Hiosu had an underwater remote camera thingy they used it in Busan Harbor, I think it was, and you saw pufferfish? Cool. Oh, we forgot this tree. Here we go. Okay, hopefully the next island we visit has peaches. <laughs> or we'll just start playing the peach song on repeat in the background. Millions of peaches. Peaches for me. Yeah. Millions of peaches. Peaches for free. Go into a country and eat a lot of peaches. Whoa! You should go to another island. Fish galore. You're bored? No, okay. you're, you're looking for... Peaches, not fish. Okay, we've done all we can here. Let's go. Let's roll. <laughs> That's a factorino? <laughs> Don't do it, he says. I mean, I never really thought about it. Oh, that's what we wanted to try today. The green screen. So it didn't have a box. Well, it's too late now. Why? Or we can still try it. Yeah, we just gotta go on the phone. Really? Yes! Yeah, everything's down on the phone. We'll oh, just don't turn do around. that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Just turn it around. Oh, no. What? This that way it has to be green screen? Just wait. Nope. Oh my gosh. Oh no, what happened? <laughs> I think you hit this. Nope. Ah! <laughs> Sam! Sorry. <laughs> yeah, even better. <laughs> Perfect. <coughs> that was great. <laughs> Here, we'll turn it back around. I'll just work on that. Yeah, next camera meta for Twitch. This guy. Just had it set up perfectly Don't and worry. now... It's not blurred. <laughs> okay, no, not <laughs> Um... Send help? Yeah, we're good. Don't ask me about this tech guy. What the heck is this? The greenest of screens. Whoa, that one's kind of cool. Hey. Ooh, Ouch. Oh, sorry. It's okay. Everything's fine. Okay, back to business. It puts you more in focus yeah. than just like having everything. Portrait mode. Yeah. Whoa. Hey? Don't ask me about my boxes, okay? <laughs> Don't ask about the boxes in the background. What about the boxes? Okay. So, first things first. Let's see, with all of these pears, we can make some new stuff today. Pear gaming. Just some sound lag to fix and you're good to go? Oh no, is it lagging? No, he said it's already fixed. Oh, okay. You should have read finished. Well, you put okay. the thing in my I, vision I moved now. it. Okay, so no real new pear recipes. 
I really want a new one though. Holy, 60 stones. Is there any other pair recipes? We just need more. Nope, that's all I have. Okay, so I think how it works is like if you have a lot of pears in your pockets, they will bring more pear recipes. Maybe. It sounds logical. We, go we got all end. of that. Well, you gotta sell some stuff first. But yeah, I gotta empty some of my pockets here, Sama. Got a bunch of woods. Stinky. Looks very windy out of your island today. Yes, it is breezy. It's matching the weather outside here. I have never played Minecraft. Sam's never played Minecraft? Never touched it. The heck is that about? Never never watched videos on it. Like that that game just doesn't interest me for some reason. That sounds fun, Torino. Okay, so we're just gonna drop all of these by our house or as many as we can instead of selling them right away it can take over your life sometimes well I know that hot dish basically streams that for her main content played it because of your kids otherwise you would have never touched it that's pretty cool then too like there's some Lego set. There's some Minecraft Lego sets that are supposed to be good to invest in, but I have no real purpose of buying Minecraft though. Yeah. Welcome. We're selling. Do I even craft or just sell? Sell. We're going straight sell. We gotta get that fossil checked though, otherwise you don't make nearly as it's much. Just leave it there? Just leave it there. And we'll keep getting our weeds built up. Yep, okay. so conscious. Get me conscious. If it wasn't for the mods, you would never play it because the vanilla vor version is pretty boring. Okay, that makes that sense. That makes sense too. Uh, we picked up it takes two yeah so we'll be playing that on wednesday i think we'll start around six o'clock so we have a little more time to play than going six to nine yeah six to nine then we still have time to relax afterwards and now or do we play it during the day like we normally would stream oh i don't know what would you guys rather us do play games at night time or during the day like we normally would stream. I'll also put a message out on Discord. I'm going to answer this poll that I just saw is sneakily put up there. How do you spell tire? Six votes for the I way. Probably the Y way is more European, I would say. Nighttime games, Torino? Yeah, that's what we were thinking. Well, nighttime games I can play. Let's see. Next island, Let's see. there better be peaches. Let's get peachy. Okay, I'm feeling good about it. Should we change our outfit to manifest more peaches in our life? It's a pretty crazy outfit. <laughs> the loser. Sometimes you just feel like digging a hole. Minecraft fills that need. <laughs> Like, I've, I've played Terraria and all those other games, and I just, 
I just don't understand Minecraft. Torino, your pepper plants are almost a foot high already. One month of growth. Had to trim them. They might be bolting a bit if they have some not enough sunlight. That might be causing that. But that's awesome. Hopefully they produce a lot of fruit. Yeah, bonk. American versus Queen's English pull. <laughs> Palooza. Your weed plant is over your head now. Good one. Good one. Oh, that's cool, Torino. In the arrow garden is where you're growing it. Sam Bonk says you can get a mod for Minecraft that changes the bricks to Lego. Okay, you can't just do that. It's over now, Bonk. <laughs> That's it. You can't just throw that out there. Are you not allowed, Torino? Not allowed to grow your own in Manitoba. Which, how does that make sense? Considering, like, BC, you're allowed... What? Four plants per household? Yep. Let's go peaches. Let's go peaches. We have so many peach recipes to build. I'm gonna close my eyes. Surprise me. Come on, peaches. No! The bamboo is still pretty okay. And we can have two pounds in the house at one time, I think. Just came legal on July 1st, Palooza. Same deal for plant. Four plants per household, two per adult. Nutso. Okay, well, we got some bamboo in our life now. We're definitely gonna chop all of that down. And let's get a shovel going on here. Sammy, click on the link, that's for you. Yes, even some bamboo shoots. The bamboos I have on my island haven't been making shoots. And I have some recipes that needed those. Yeah, four plants per adult. Oof. That's a bit much. Go, go, go. And what's with all the pansy flowers? Give us something different. Okay, that's pretty sweet. Tommy's loving it. He's checking it out. Guy down. The road got popped shortly after it went legal. He had a greenhouse with like 70 plants. Oh no. <laughs> <clears throat> Shit. Probably went to prison for that. Sad to say. Doesn't even make sense. She otherwise has a black thumb. Torino, that's funny. Well, at least she can do that. Oh, the mod is only for the Java version, Bonk is saying, not for Windows. Of course. Oh, just digging into nothing here. Turn it around. You don't remember anymore, Torino, the platform. That's okay. That's okay. Clean up, clean up. 
That's all we are right now. Cleanup crew. Pick the weeds. Very uh, on point conversation right now. We're picking weeds. Used to be called Forge. I'm sure if we just messaged Hot Dish, she probably knows everything Minecraft. We be crafting some bamboo recipes coming up. Pumped. And I can add them to my bamboo area. Curse Forge. Okay, I think that's it for the shovel. Let's switch it up though. Because sometimes it gets boring if you just like keep picking and picking. Go to the beach, boy. Whoa, Lego Star Wars, Ninja Go, Lego Man, even. What's this gonna be? I was cleaning out, or I was cleaning, found this DIY recipe written on a piece of paper that I use as a bookmark. Didn't want to waste a good idea, so now I'm sharing it with you. It's simple if you have the parts. From Flurry. Told you! See, we're still getting peach recipes. Maybe we're getting closer. I already even know this one. <laughs> Sheesh! They're just teasing us now. <laughs> Look how shiny this one cheek is. So shine. Probably don't need the light on anymore. Yeah. Pick everything, raise it to the ground. Pretty much bonk. That's what I usually do. The sun is out now. Oh, that's much better. Much better. Okay, who turned off the lights? Phew. Brother got your daughter a Switch and she got the game and just gets lost in it for hours still. Yeah, it's so easy to do that. I usually play like half an hour to an hour a day maybe. Unless I get too busy and then I just forget and that's okay. This is all just gonna be regular bamboo. I don't think we're gonna find any spring bamboo, which is special. Why? Because you only get it in the springtime. game got really fun, I will say, once I unlocked the terraforming. It took me a while to get It's like about having enough members on your island, having enough stuff decorated for them to do. It took some work. I'm gonna try and hit every single Thing. Saw some weeds. You want to grow bamboo? Okay, we already did those ones. It grows like crazy, Torino. So, so quick. Lots of people actually grew it when we were on the island. Almost used it as like a natural fence because of how thick and quick it grows, right? but then they don't really know how to maintain it, so it just gets out of control. Yeah, that's a good way to do it. You just plant it in a pot, and then it's controlled in a space. That Especially looks nice. For 
Really? Yeah. Wow. Okay, I use all my axes now. I'm gonna have to craft some more. Then you can plant some in the empty lots. Yeah, just start planting bamboo. Such a good resource, why not? Why the heck not? Found it interesting how the game softens when you get your good rating from KK. Yeah, I was, I was interested in that too. I was like, that's it? Kind of freaked me out, Bonk. But that wasn't really it. It's like getting to the level, the level cap in World of Warcraft. You're like, yeah, I finished the game. I leveled up. No, that's when it begins. <laughs> Yeah, we've only scratched the surface. I follow some Animal Crossing players on Instagram, kind of <laughs> for inspiration. So crazy, some of the islands that they have made. Okay, where did we stop here? Here? <laughs> Warcraft, you mean Warcraft? I have never touched the game in my life. I've seen it being played. Not really my style, but I can understand it. It's pretty cool how you get like so many people together for the raid, stuff like that. A never ending way too game. Much. Yeah, I could see that, Sammy. <laughs> I could see that. Kept me safe until I met you. Kept you out of trouble? Yep. That's good. <laughs> it's 20 bucks a month Canadian? No, it's like 15 now. Was it more expensive before? No. No, I don't think so. If you think about it, $15 a month for how many hours of game time that you'll actually play if you like the game is way worse than buying a new game every month. The Sammy logic. I don't know. You prioritize your money in your own way. <laughs> but like, you only pay that when you're actively playing the game. No, I think it's only $12. Bonk, you could easily lose six hours a day in the game. Easily. Yeah, if you calculate it that way, then it is I think worth I it. have one year or more game time. So take 356 days times 24 hours, and that's how many hours I've played, roughly. Chop the bamboo. Just one character, too. Always another quest. Always another thing to craft. Always another raid boss. Like eight and a half thousand hours. How many hours are in a year? That's how many hours are in a year. Oh, okay. I think I did all the <clears throat> bamboozles. Lots of grinding for herbs. Herbages? Herbages. Okay, we chopped all the trees. We didn't catch any bees. Nor did we find peaches, so we're out of here. Gotta go. <clears throat> Ain't nobody got time for that. Like, I kind of want to play with Dust and play Classic and play Burning Crusade. But I did all that when it was content. And it was fun then. I don't want to do it again. I think you quit WoW after the fourth year, fell in love with it when you played the beta. I think a lot of people said that. Yeah, so I played WoW until Pandaria, and then I was done. Because I didn't play Cataclysm. 
I tried another one, but then it stopped right away. Let's see. Bamboo. In our life, is there things that we have not crafted yet? Yes. I don't think I ever finished Pandaria though, because that's when Caitlin and I started dating. If you ever want to play WoW with someone that's fun and knows his stuff, look up Bradical. He's a Canadian, Torino says. Thanks, Torino. I can't see here whether I've crafted that yet or not. <clears throat> I think I have though. Okay, let's go craft something yours. Make some bamboo partitions for our bamboo part of the island. That'll look cool. New stuff. Heck yeah. We're finding peaches today. Don't even tell me otherwise. We picked up 87 pieces of bamboo from there. No shortage here. Should we do... Let's do like three of these. The most serious crafting face. Oh. Oh, there's a stool. I've not made the bench yet. Gotta do that too. Two benches for sure. Two more days and it's Canadian Streamer Application Month. Well, for you anyhow. You made it up. What does that mean, Torino? What is this all about? This is new. This is a really cute one, little bamboo. Look at the onigiris in there. Is that a little radish? Oh, appreciation. Oh, that's right, application. <laughs> my eyes are not quite synced to my brain yet. That's right, I saw your little tweet about it. Canadian Streamer Appreciation Month. Thanks for nominating me, dude. Mary, I found a hidden object game on Google Play. So I'm back. Welcome back, Mary. The game took you for a wild ride. Oh no, Palooza. I know it. I I think it's totally off as well, the the voice sync with video, but that's fine. We'll probably need a full restart for that to actually be proper. Sweet Torino. Yeah, do I need glasses? I might. I might just. <clears throat> the link to YouTube is me doing Lich King 11 years ago on hard mode, I think. It was the first one on the server. That's an old video. I'm gonna say, where did you dig that video up from? YouTube. One of the guys. You put that on there? No. Uh, okay, real quick, we gotta get this present. Our Death Knight put it on there for us. Sammy went back, back, back. Get oh, the it was just normal. And then all the other ones were on there. Flashy flower sign. I feel like I've already had that before. That's fine. Okay. Back to crafting, because this is how you make money. Use your skills. Probably just gonna make a bunch of these because I think this uses the highest amount of bamboo pieces. Go give all of the islanders a bamboo wall. Man, that sun coming in. Makes me look so shiny. Ten 
nine man is much easier than 25. Getting that many people to coordinate was a nightmare, right? Sammy told me stories about this. Oh, you can go quicker, Mary, by pressing A, oh, like, multiple times, and then you go super quick. It's how you save time, otherwise it does use a lot of time if you just do it like this, like letting it go, so you just go way quicker. Okay, what else we got extra here? Probably tree branches. Nope, not really. Should we try and craft, where's this new wall that we got? Oof, 15. That's a lot of wood to use up for that. You don't think, Sammy? Hey, don't even think it would be possible to get 25 people now. I wonder. What else? Perfect. Three extras that we had. Use that up. Don't know if there's anything else extra. How's our softwood? Perfect. I always like to have it at like by 30. 30 of each. So that you always have enough to craft things if you run out. Now... Was there any weed? Okay. Weed recipes. Clumps of weeds, 163. I think our pockets are almost full as well. We'll go until we can't go anymore. Dunzo. Okay. First thing we're gonna do before we sell things, because sometimes I sell it by accident. Let's go drop our things where we wanted. This is my little bamboo area. Oh look! Pearl is doing some yoga. Good job, Pearl. Taking care of your mental health and wellness. Okay, bamboo partition. We even created a bench. So what if I pop the bench like in front of this? Would be cool. Push it forward. Nice. Have a little seat. Hee <laughs> hee. I like it. And I think I'll put one more up here. I'm not really loving these two chairs. Let's put a bench. I think we made more than one. Yes. Way better. What else? There was this little lunchy box. Forget what this one is. What's that? Oh, the drum? Okay, we'll pop that down lower then. Put the little snack back there. Have a have a little picnic, if you will. I'm gonna push it back a bit more. Oh, I wonder. Can we do this? Oh, I wasn't supposed to do that. Can we put the lunchbox on the table? I don't think so. 
unless I wasn't aiming. Yeah! Sweet! That... I'm putting that there because I like it. Why? Because I like it. Was there one more bench? Just the lecture hall one. Hi, Timber! Yeah, I like playing some games too. This is mostly the only game I ever play. Animal Crossing. We finished our menu planning pretty quick. So I thought before, uh, before we went, we would play a little games together too. We're looking for peaches currently. Okay, these partitions, it might look really cool right here. We set it up. Or we can almost make like a little private pool area. Let's see how that looks. Okay, that's pretty cool looking. How do they look side by side? One over on this side. I mean, do I love that though? Not really loving it. Got a different idea. So I just opened up this area too with this ramp. I'm gonna put them right here. sun's room I can't even describe the smell I think I used half a can of Febreze we don't even want to know what is he doing in there that's a sheesh for sure how does this look from down below whoa the curve of it looks pretty cool I will for sure make like two more of those Line it up. Yeah, those darn stinky teenagers. We can say that because we've all been there. What is this flashy flower sign? Pretty sure I know what it is. I think I have two already. Oh, but not of this caliber. Hey, Pollen Jock! Yep, yeah. every now and then I play a little bit of Animal Crossing on stream. We're putting flashy flower sign right here. This is a little wedding area. Welcome. Welcome in. I'm not fully happy with how this is either. Just collecting things. Yeah, pro AC streamer. Okay, I think the rest of this is all extra. Bamboo wall decoration. Yeah, I already have that. Have a rug. This uh, dark wooden mosaic wall, though, we need to go store. Oh yeah, we dressed up as a samurai today. Going by our games area. Let's do a switch. What's up, E?
you want to do a quick refresh to make sure that your audio is synced at least? If you're going to keep on playing? It won't take long. Like, literally just shut down OBS and turn it back on. The stream will stop for 10 seconds. No, it's okay. Okay. What is happening here? John. Hi. I was wondering if you would like to visit our daughter's dream? We've recently updated it. We have so much themes outside. We also have eight houses. Six are themed. We have a police station, hospital, cinema, gym, haunted house. We have an astrological dig area, a farm. So much more than you're welcome to visit if you would like. If I understand, if you don't have time or don't visit dreams, though. I've never done that before. So I've never done a dream thing, and I don't even know how to do that. How is this possible, John? I got some time. I'm a rookie a bit, though. And yeah, I am in Edmonton. Is it a trap, Torino? I feel like it's not. I don't know. Would they trap me like that? That's not fair. That wouldn't be very nice. Try it. Oh, this is John. Yeah. Lay in your bed and see Luna. Is this a uh, Lauren's Johnny? The one that she says is exactly like my husband, Sammy. This must be it. Where's Bonk? No, not you. Oh, <laughs> not the same John. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Johnny Teacup is Lauren's John. <laughs> Glad we got the Johns figured out. Or T Min. Now we're all confused here. Go to the bed and sleep. Try it. I'm just getting changed first. Johnny Teacup. I think I like that better though, Torino. Johnny Teacup's pretty good. Okay, give me one moment. Just doing a quick switch up here. It's getting quite warm. Oh, I better go quick before chat gets that code gone. Let's just go simple. Okay, we're going crazy. Astro dress. Go, go, go. Where's my zap boots? <laughs> Ensure the gate is shut? Okay. <laughs> okay, we're completely pre prepped for dreaming here. Yeah, last time I was like, okay, I'll just get some sleep. And it's like... Going for a dream. Had no idea. Oh no! Welcome, welcome. The binary fields are what? Beaming with beautiful dreams? This is new, Mary. This is new. I want to dream. <laughs> I like the option. Like, I'm so sweaty right now. Where am I? That was the question that I had, I think. It's like, where am I? Let me wake up. Oh my gosh, we're connecting to the interwebs. This is new. How shall you prepare it? That's Shift the address? address. Yep. We're always learning, John. We actually have an educational focus cooking stream most of the time. So this is a one-off. We got DA6517 
We're coming over, John. This better not be a trap. I'm terrified. We're browsing. <laughs> we're still connecting to the interwebs, just to, if you were wondering. No wonder it's lagging. It's paradise. <laughs> Appears to be for an island called Paradise. Okay, we're going from Wild Garden to Paradise. This sounds nice. Where are we going? I have no idea, Timber. Let's find out. This is correct. Thanks for sharing, John. That's so generous of you and thoughtful. Okay, we'll close our eyes. And relax. Roll the dice on paradise. Oh, where are we going for peaches? We gotta go to different islands using a Nook Miles ticket. Gotta buy a plane ticket and go traveling. Yeah, your daughter's had your switch for over a year. No idea what the island even looks like now, Bonk. So this is another way to like explore people's islands? I guess so. Most certainly look in houses as well as outside themes. I'm sure you will love your visit. Thanks, John. Yeah, you can shake the peaches. I know that. When you wish to awaken, you only need to lie down back in my comfy bed. I love the little, like, genie thing puffing. Is this safe? <laughs> So now you can see how different this is from our island. Whoa, white bricks. This is an upgrade. What do we do? Just look around. Have fun exploring. What? How do you get all this stuff? Look at this pizza area. I'm going slow because it's kind of leggy. Yep. That's okay. Um, first off, John, I'll just live here now. Just saying. What you got here? What's in the oven? A margarita. We got a... Or... Is it a pepperoni? Maybe a pepperoni. Margarita. Yeah, cookie. Heather, the dream address lets people visit and they cannot take anything or change anything on the island. Word. So like a very safe way. That's so cool can visit friends' islands, but have peaches instead of wasting the plane tickets. Oh, I know that, Paul and Jock. I do have a lot of Nook Miles to use up anyways, though. Look at this cool little area. Little flower, flower assembly station by an arrangement. One thing you don't like with Dreams is it does a little leggy, but it gets better. Okay, sounds good. This is a lot of new stuff to me. We'll just walk slow. Like this fish market stuff. Is that all custom things that you have bought or you made? This is cool. Drying racks. Drying the finches. Squid. Octopus. A fish. What's in the pot? Tomato sauce. Making Detroit style pizzas. A little fruit stand. This is totally bringing me back to like Southeast Asia. There's just smoothie stands everywhere. Hello, I would like to order one coconut smoothie. Thank you. Surf shop. I never really thought to build up stuff on the beach like this. Smart though. Look at all the cool different surfboards. That must be different customizations too. Timber. To buy peaches in real life, we have to look for them. I don't know. Are you in Canada? They come mostly from BC, sometimes from Ontario. The Okanagan. 
Running is fine on dreams, it makes no damages. Okay, I was just trying to get it to not lag. So I was going slow motion. Cool, now we get some inspiration. Look at that flower. What is that flower? I like that. Hello, friend. We have Tammy. <laughs> yeah, you're new, not me. It's so nice. It's totes dreamy. Look at this spot. Just uh, settle on in for a, a show. The musical act. Oh, I gotta still work on my island so much. I don't even know obviously not gotten to five stars yet thanks for the info grows on top of the mountain holy look at this big conch got a little picnic area look at this cute mushroom so now my community can see how much i have not done because everyone thinks that I built up an awesome island. Didn't even make a dent. I love these little mushroom things though. Park and beep beep. Do you, can we check other people's mail? No. Hello? Knock knock. I'm coming in. Whoa. Is this the main spot? Look at the security camera. Kind of terrified. Knockity knock. <laughs> Little staff room. <laughs> Tighten you up. Hello, come on in. <laughs> How's your Monday going, dude? The medic? Is this the doctor's office? It must be. Oof. Nice. This is all new. I do have this little thing. Doot, doot, doot. They even got the scale, everything. Insane. Pro work done on here, for sure. Oh, dang. Dang, Titan. Just like random things going on, or is there like a reason the internet went out? Monday so far is good. We planned out our menu for the week of streaming coming up Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. And now we're just finishing up relaxing with some Animal Crossing. And John shared a dream code with us. So we're visiting his daughter's island. Because this is new for us. Oh, you can go up and down. Okay, so that's the next upgrade for my house then. I have an upstairs, but I don't have a downstairs yet. Look at this. The operating room. I like how it's all dark. Oh, I went out by accident. There's some serious stuff going on in there. Nice. And then this is where you go to get better. Look at all the good schnackas. You found some peaches, Timber? In real life? <laughs> yeah, where's all the hot nurses? To, or Titan. This is Animal Crossing. Come on now. What the heck? Okay, wait, why are you finding peaches? Like, we're trying to find the peaches in the game. 
love all these too. I don't even know whose address that is. Not ours, luckily. The gym? Timber's finding us peaches in real life. 172nd Street, 95th Ave Northwest. <laughs> okay, Jim Rules, H&W Produce. I know that place where I've heard of them. This is a legitimate gym. Look at all the proteins. We're going to be here forever. Sama returned with Rito Rito snacks. And Titan, there is honeybees in the game. Oh no. Okay, settle up on your Pelotons. It's time for a spin class. It is a burrito cookie. We ordered, because we were still hungry a bit yesterday after the tartare from stream, we ordered some mucho burrito. It was yummy. <laughs> Thanks, Timber. <laughs> okay, we gotta go to H&W Produce, Sammy. What? The peaches are there waiting for us. The what? yoga room? <laughs> I'm dead right now. Thank you for calling. <laughs> you didn't have to do that. The security cameras in every shop though were kind of freaking me out. I guess it's for safety reasons only. Hey, at least there's not security cam in here. The shower room. So cool. The amount of work put into this is insane. So much respect. Yep. So much respect. Like upstairs, downstairs. Each one of these upstairs, downstairs houses, I'm pretty sure is 1.248 million bells. <laughs> and so far, every single one we went in has up and down. Doctors are going to the hospital first. Like, I still need to find these. I got a treadmill, got the weight bench, all that other stuff. Good Rito snack? Mm -hmm. What's down here? What's usually in the basement of a gym? Nice! Wrestling ring. Ring the bell. That's for you, chat. Everyone who's sticking with us today, watching. Maybe get a couple, a uh, couple of punches in. Body slam, Sama. Come and get me. Love how you just sleep in the wrestling ring. I told you yours. <laughs> no. Yeah. I wrapped mine in this. Did you? Okay. No, I didn't. Sammy is feeling Fine like, as wine. Like almost a normal human again. Finally got test back. COVID free. So that is very, very good news, Titan. Must have just been a crazy 24 hour flu. I've never seen a flu hit like that before. This is a scary be hard. place. Police station. Wanted. Is that you, Titan? <laughs> is that you up on the wall? That's you, yeah, wanted. I'll trade you antibodies for smoked meat. This is the 
bosses. Look at the surveillance on all the walls. I love it. That's a good trade. Trading antibodies for food? Sounds like a win-win to me. Gift donuts, yeah. If only you could like pick them up and eat them in the game, Mary. We got some of those at home too. Don't fret, they're up in the food room. We'll go back and have snacks. Sweet. Like this is crazy. Yeah, fresh donuts right out of the fryer. Oh, the interrogation room. I swear, I didn't take the donut. <laughs> <laughs> Let me out. <laughs> Where's the door? Yeah, that used to be a Sunday thing in the restaurant. Leftover pancake batter, scooped into the deep fryer, turned in to donuts. It was Mary. Mary took the donuts. <laughs> this is where all the work gets done. <laughs> yeah, was there... There's no icing sugar. I don't know about that white powder you're talking about. Criminal record, donut stealer. Oh no! This is where you go, Titan. Titan's wanted for stealing the donuts. Shh. I love this too. <laughs> yeah, I've already been in jail once. <laughs> Angel face. Either way, you're done, Torino. Whether it's the sugar from the donuts or cocaine, you're done. You're not getting out alive. Okay, we've not gone over here yet. Does this have different stuff, this store? Look at how slow it goes when you get close to the bed. I think we gotta go around the other way. Oh, Lee, there's a person. This is Kim. Hi, Kim. Island design extraordinaire. Hello, friend. Yeah, it's medicinal. Whoa. Whoa. What is this little area? Moons. Touch! I'm loving it. I really want to find all these little mushroomies. This is medicinal too. I got this little pond rock. I'm loving the mushrooms though. We got this fountain. Cool. <laughs> <coughs> hey, that would have been an experience, Titan. Oh, this is just back to Dodo? Okay, we don't have to go there. Nice. Got a little KK set up. We thought our beach, our beach band party was legit. Look at that. Oh, I like this little thing. Hello, little friend. Gail. That's definitely like the Gail that we know. Remember Gail? Bruce's mom? Yeah. That's Gail. Bruce. Is this Gail's house? We're coming in. That's good, Titan. Charges were dismissed. 
That's what's important here. Look at this nice house. What is this? Very cozy. And like we have our bookcases set up the same way. So that's kind of freaky too. A little bit freaky. Go play the drums next. Oh yeah, we can go back into the band area. I don't have any of the game sound right now. So I'm just trying to do all the fun stuff for you guys. We can, uh, here's our pina colada boba coming right on up. Yes. Anyone need a quick shot of espresso? Double shot pour. It doesn't work. Hello? We broke it. Take an omelet. Okay, you get microwave omelet then. You can live in my shed. You get some toast with that omelet though. You're welcome. Torino and Titan, your place settings are right here. Okay, pina colada is ready. Good to go. Get the toast. <laughs> Bacon strips? Oh, I'll have to go searching for that. Cutest. Mmm, homemade blackberry jam for the toast. Hey, that's funny. I put my bathroom on this side too. Look at that. Look at that rainfall, rain shower head. Yes, please. Bonk's got to go to work still? Okay, Bonk. You have a good day at work and thanks for hanging out the whole time with us. I appreciate that. Try not to work too hard today. Hopefully everything goes great and we won't see you tomorrow. Cool. What? Are these all of the Animal Crossing people then? Animal Crossing animals? Oh, it's a good time for ice cream? Yes. Good time for boba. Yeah, we're almost done. Sammy's got a Nancy, he needs some boba in his life. This is a cool room for sure. That aesthetic though. Let's just be honest, I don't have like 90% of these items that are in this island. Insanity. I want this shelf. Give me this. Give me this. villagers you've had there's hundreds though so cool oh yeah downstairs whoa the playroom hee <laughs> hee little hamster nice one it's like totally the daughter's playroom the log in front of the window? Oh, good question, Mary. I don't know, maybe John will answer. Just cuz. That's what we'll go with. Okay, we'll go one more place. We're almost done. Mary said play with the drums as well. I think we can. Can we? No. Let's go say hi. Can you suggest two more? Sure. Dr. Vesto. No. Time for my checkup. Oh, <gasps> that's a lot of puppers. That's a lot of puppers. That's my kind of island. To the right is a haunted house. Kate. 
like this? I'm guessing it's this. I love the black roses too. I've been looking for those. <laughs> hee hee hee! Then top left house is the cinema and two mountains if you like animals. Okay. Whoa. Okay, it's getting spooky. We're getting ready for fall. Real spooky. A haunted dinner, if you will. Aldrin. And look at all the other mushroomies too. Spooky buggies. I like this though. Whoa, I just saw the massive tarantula as I left that room. I didn't know the gears on the wall they turned or maybe that's a different scent that one I have how do you even build multiple houses like this like, how is that a thing? I thought you could only build one house. Do you just have to pay off the first one? And then you can build more after that? Oh, that sounds yummy. Treated myself to four big scoops of caramel crunch ice cream. Sammy's face. Nice, this is a cool spot too. Spooky dinner. The bar or spooky bar. Okay. Mary's keeping me on point. Oh. Per like AC Island, you can have up to eight accounts. Right. Okay. That makes sense then. Okay, should I go around this way then? I like those little chairs. Whoa. What is that? The pumpkin patch. Nice. That must be all custom then. It's like I got these things. I just didn't customize them the same way. Love this little fire pit area. That looks cozy. <laughs> I still have yet to capture a scorpion. They keep like falling into the water, running away. Is that a thing that they do? Oh, lots of sand dollar stuff. Yeah, so cool. I don't think we can shake the peach tree. Oranges, cherries, apples. Shake the peach tree. Oh no! Is this how we get our peaches? Pick it up. Are we completing the peaches? There you go, done. We need at least three. <laughs> okay, we're. 
<coughs> Let's see if this gets through from the dream. John, what's going on right now? <laughs> John's running the stream. You'll catch me a rattlesnake? Okay. Holy smokes, look at this area. Bike rentals? Library? This top area is massive. The cinema. Oh, it's okay. If it doesn't come through to the dream, that was just good wishing. Like, we're trying to find our own. I don't know why they keep evading me. Oh, Alien, Jurassic Park, Jaws. <laughs> the little maintenance room. <laughs> That's so accurate. Total. Everything just jumbled in with the mop supplies. Torino, is there a ramen place anywhere in there? In the game? Oh, you know what we found yesterday when we were on the Skip the Dishes app? You can order from Cineplex here popcorn. <laughs> yeah. And pop. For like $30, you get two popcorns and a pop. It's like, that's ridiculous. Who's paying that? You know how many popcorn kernels you can buy for that? These must just be all separate theaters. But. You know what assuming does. Oh no, it's Saw! Even with the creepy tricycle. Ah! Run! <laughs> that was way too good, hey Mary? Run away! Nice. A little cocoa. What a setup. Unfortunately, you only have native one fruit, then one other on Tropical Island. Give you our life dote if you want to visit via flight. Shake our trees. I think we'll do one more stream trying to find them. And then if not, for sure. Like the, like all of these take so much stuff to make, guys, because they need gold and stars. That's so cool. Yeah, we have not gone to a movie in so long to Torino. So long. Oh, I love how you did the museum all the way up here. That's unique. <laughs> I can't even look at the wedding one. Because <laughs> if we think back to my island, <laughs> yeah, this is my wedding area. <laughs> Oh no. Terrible. Thanks for the follow, John. Yeah, pop in our Discord. We have a little game section if you want to post Animal Crossing stuff there. Feel free. And if you're into cooking and food, eating, stuff like that, feel free to share that sort of stuff too. Love this carpet. Total throwback. <laughs> Did the picture freeze turntable? What? You're a chef as well, John? So cool. This little generator site. Okay, it's good for us. It might just be you, turntable. Sad to say. This is the excavation site. Oh man, Jurassic Park. The amber egg with the mosquito. The amount of problems that caused. Look at this. This is satisfying the most satisfaction. I have so much work to do. 
<laughs> Lauren, Lauren, send help and welcome. How are you doing today? Happy Monday, friend. We're in a dream visiting John's daughter's island that they built. How cool is this right now? I need this thing. And then it was funny, Lauren, because I asked John, I'm like, are you Lauren's Johnny? And he's like, no, I'm not that John. <laughs> we were like, oh, okay. This looks like Uki. It's John. Hi, John. <laughs> <laughs> In another life, I was a pirate. Lauren, did you get some sleepies in or what? Oh, another little pet area? Why does this island seem way bigger than mine? Oh, duckies. Of course the cop would be in the schnaka area. <laughs> Not against any cops in chat. <laughs> Excuse me, sir. I would like to go that way, though. This is not my island. In another life, this could be my island. Oh my gosh, there's even more. Where did this come from? Okay, I can't. John, we gotta save this for another day. I don't even know my way back to the bed. We're stuck in the dream. No, it's just the middle. Is this an inception? No, it's okay. I'm just joking. <laughs> I will find my way back somehow. Dax. Okay, we got it. Am I getting there? Oh yeah. Uh, yeah, I'm getting there. I think. I went too far. You're waking up from a nap, Lauren. Weren't feeling super good, but you're good now. Yeah, the bakery. This island is kitted. Hey, I remember this area. I think it was here. Yes. Phew. Imagine getting caught in a dream. In a game. I want to wake up, please. Now imagine the shrill tones of the alarm clock. Thanks, John, for the visit and the invite. That was so fun. So much inspiration. And like I said, the amount of work that I have to do. Dead. Yeah, Maya, that's why we're finishing up. I know the vid and sound isn't in sync. Yep. It sucks. Look how you wake up from sleeping. That's actually so good. So cute. Okay, we made it out and this is real life again. Okay, great stream, guys. This is where I like to finish my stream. Let's go to the food room. Okay, sounds good, John. Thanks for joining our Discord. That's so awesome. Head chef and... Plays Animal Crossing for his daughter. Unreal. Okay, this is where we're finishing. All right, friendos. Here, Torino, there's the ramen for you. Do you see it? Tonkatsu. Yeah, I refreshed the heck out of the stream. <laughs> it still didn't work, Maya says. 
You too, Ernest. Thanks, guys, for hanging out. We got our menu plan for the week on this stream. We got our grocery list made. We're good to go. If you want to know what we're cooking, I'm just going to post the menu right after this, after I get off on Discord and Twitch. And all of the recipes are already posted in Discord if you want to cook along. Like Mary said, she's probably going to do the strawberry lemon bars with us on Saturday. Why not? If you're in a close time zone, it's possible. We can cook together. That's called cook with Kate. Spreading the deliciousness here. Lauren, sorry that we're finishing up like right as you come in. I'm just going to set up a raid. Who are we going to go raid today, friendos? LA. LA? A hunger service raid? Where is he at? Is this accurate? It's right here. Oh. Red lentil doll and roti. I like that. Or Maya likes the otters. They are cute too in Vancouver where we used to live. LA came and hang out or hung out with us the other day on stream. It was really nice to also be able to make a Filipino dish with him the chicken adobo. So we're gonna go visit him. I feel like we haven't been spending enough time together. And he's making, it looks like vegetarian food today, some Indian foods, red lentil dal and some roti, so like a pita bread. Okay friends, so we will be back on Wednesday. We'll do a little bit of game and stream or are we gonna leave that out for this week? Up to you. Okay. I wasn't well, leave it in, okay. Gaming stream Wednesday coming up. I'll let you know the time on that on the updated schedule, and then we'll be cooking Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, like always. Yeah, it's such a cute channel, the Otters. Okay. Thank you everyone for hanging out with us. Thank you for all the support today. If you did contribute anything to our community, other than that, we're gonna leave you. If you need us around at all, we'll be on Discord and Twitch. So feel free to message us there. All right, let's go see LA and wish him a happy week as well. I'ma press this button. Stay safe, stay healthy wherever you are. And we'll see you on Wednesday. Bye!